So I just made Becky a salad. I'm gonna have me like a veggie patty, but chicken, arugula, baby arugula, some red seedless grapes, cucumber, and I think I said chicken already. Oh my gosh. Oh, and this is the dressing. Panera bread, balsamic vinaigrette, and it's low sodium, so. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. So I'm having some grapes, which I already ate some. A bagel with a veggie patty, cucumber, and very light layer of cream cheese. So that's what I'm having. So right now I'm cooking Becky and I dinner. Right here we just have some green beans boiling. These are fresh green beans from the produce aisle. We're gonna have a little bit of pasta and shrimp. I use water for everything, but I have water and some Pam cooking spray on this. Look at that baby right there. She is all tuckered out. She's had a long and adventurous day today. All right, so there is our dinner. It looks good. And no, I do not cut off the ends. Don't come for me in the comments because I know you will, but yeah. It looks a little messy right here, but. So I'm kind of nervous for the green beans because <laughs> making fresh green beans to me is hard because I'm not like used to it. So I'm gonna do a little taste test. It's okay. Um, I didn't add any salt. We're doing a thing where we don't add any salt to anything. All I added was garlic powder and garlic salt, which is like, Sodium free or whatever. <sighs> yep, yep. I can definitely tell. Mm. The shrimp is good though. And the pasta, plain. Which I enjoy. Mm. Taking a bite of the shrimp and the pasta together is like for the win, so. Guys. I'm gonna make fresh salmon for the first time ever. And I'm a little nervous. So I'm gonna set the oven. I need just one of these. Let's just set it right here. Let's see, Eric and Ricky's. Put that down. And I need. Some aluminum foil. And I actually said aluminum right. Wow. So put it on there. I'm sure everyone knows how to make salmon. It's like probably not that difficult. So I'm gonna use Pam spray for my seasonings, garlic salt. We're gonna do some pepper and probably some onion powder. Okay, now you guys get to see the beautiful salmon. Look at that, it's a honker. I will not be eating all that. Look. So I did get it from Kroger. It was 487. Salmon Atlantic. Ooh, I'm excited. So I'm gonna spray this. We do not want it to stick. I also do not want to touch the salmon. Nope. So I'm going to use a fork to get it out. So this is probably two servings for sure, or at least to me it is. Um, and there's skin on the bottom, so I'm kind of like weirded out. Do you guys see it? <laughs> Okay, we're gonna add 
garlic salt. Onion powder. And pepper. I love pepper. Bam. Ta-da. I like super seasoned stuff. But what I'm going to do is, because I saw someone else do it, Kind of like gently pat it in if you will so and then tiny like that because i want it to get golden golden <laughs> i like my meat really dry hi that's me so i want it to get super super like dry and the ends to get like kind of crispy so I'm gonna wait for the oven to be done. It's almost done. So I have leftovers from last night. If I can open it. Really just brown rice and cauliflower and broccoli. So I'm gonna warm it up. You guys, look, completed. So it's juicy. Is it supposed to be? I'm gonna check the middle. This is like a first time thing, so I wanted to do it on here. The middle is the most important. Oh yeah, it's cooked. Eric said he eats the skin. I was so excited. I took a bite without vlogging. Wow, I'm so confused. Oh my God, what is happening right now? I've always had, like I said, processed frozen salmon or from a um, restaurant. So this is like, it's like buttery or something. I'm so confused. I didn't even add butter. You guys make the salmon just how I made it. Your life will never be the same. Y'all, I'm sorry if this grosses you out, but I ate the whole thing. I was freaking hungry. The skin is a no-go. I, nope, I did not like that part. And the part in between the skin and the actual um, filet has this brown part, which is actually where the omega-3 is at. So I ate some of it on one side, but I didn't eat the other side because, you know, I don't need that much fat, let's be real. This was incredible. I'll be doing this again, but I definitely don't think I needed the whole piece. That's just my opinion. So next time I think before I even plate it, I'm just gonna cut it in half to save the other half for another time. So I'm pretty much done with the dishes. We just have that little bit left and some stuff soaking in the sink. But I'm about to make me some lunch. I have made this before recently. It's really good, so I'm gonna show you guys kind of what it is. All right, so first things first, onion, baked potato. We're gonna need some veggie. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the chicken in just like really small pieces, season it how you want, cook it in a pan, microwave this, microwave this, obviously chop the onion 
any size you want. Cook it with the um, chicken and I'll show you guys the next step. Pretty simple. It's gonna be weird to some of you guys. I have a weird taste bud, I guess, but it's actually really good. So the chicken and onions are doing their thing. I do cook with water instead of oil. It saves on calories for sure, so. And we have the broccoli and cauliflower and carrots, done. Baked potato in the microwave. This is gonna be a little bit of leftovers. My plate ready to go so I can show you guys how I plate it. Okay, you guys, now it's time for the plating. Gonna get me a spoon. First thing I do, veggies. This is a lot better with steamed, fresh broccoli. Just trust me on that, please. <laughs> now that I've learned to like truly cook steamed broccoli, it's like my jam. Okay, now I'm gonna get me butter knife. We're going to open, this is freaking hot. <laughs> this. Y'all are gonna think I'm crazy, but that's okay. Place it on top. I'm not trolling, I swear. You're going to cut it in half. Whew. Open it. You guys literally see the steam, cause I do. <laughs> you guys are gonna take your chicken. Place it in the middle, like so. Just enough, just enough, I meant to say, <laughs> to satisfy you. Then, salsa. Um, pour it, whatever you want to do, to your liking. Put that on top. And then, the hot sauce. Which, this comes out super slow, <laughs> so, bam. Dinner is served. And I know this looks crazy, but trust me, this is bomb, right here. And I didn't mean to say dinner, I meant to say lunch, but either way. Angle in, so, obviously, it's all meant to be eight together like so. Chicken, veggie, potato. Mm -mm. Super good. I'm down with it. Mm -hmm. 